Highlighting the nose is something of the, the late 2000s, not the 90s. We're trying to be a period piece today. Somebody says Shorty looked like she worked at the gas station. I've been live for like a few years. Oh, the hat's attached to the pigtails. It's it's like really in there. She's so persuasive, that marijuana. She's so flirtatious. How does it feel to be so persuasive? Explain that. Is it just me? Why? Hank is cute. Mm. It's fucking cute. In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion. Never mind. Okay. I used to be scared of wearing baseball caps because they never looked good on me. But then I saw Rihanna wearing them and now I wear them. But I feel like when I put on one of these, I feel like a discount Rihanna. Like I feel really cute. I feel cuter than I ever was. But at the same time, I still feel like, like Rihanna from Shein. Because this is this is what what's freaking me out. Something's really spooking me right now. You wanna know what's spooking me? These bracelets came with a set of things, such as candy nipple pasties, candy thong, candy this, candy that, candy this. What does this look like it goes around? Cause it could be two things. It could be or it could be, you get, you have the candy sex, then you have a candy baby. And the baby comes out after you had your candy sex nine months later, and then it's for, it's a bracelet for the baby. Okay, whatever that means. Because when you were conceiving him, it was candy related. It was candy themed sex. So you give the bracelet to the, but that seems a little fucked up. So therefore, we are going to rest on, rest our case. It's a cock ring. However, no one's worn it. I've been tasting it, tastes fine. Is it suspect? Alex, is it suspect? You don't know what I'm saying to you, huh? Not a thought going through that head. I gotta write a rap, you guys. So I'm gonna make a beat. That's fucking, that's it. That's a fucking smash. Here we go. Oh my God. We're getting there though. Bruh. Taco Bell and look at my nails. Look at that. I'm not making any fucking beats with these. Like I need like, like dinky, like really like blonky ass sounds, like some clunky ass, some shit. No, no, no. I need Disney. That's what I want. I want Disney. I want, I want fucking the Wiggles. I want all of that shit. Yes. Taco Bell just sent me something. I don't know if I'm. Fuck all. Fuck. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm glad they sent that to me. Fuck you. But I'm glad that you sent that to me.
does though. <laughs> That's dope. That, that's a quack. That's the best quack we could get. That didn't even sound like a fucking duck. It sounded like an old man having a stroke. <laughs> Funny fart sounds collection, royalty free farting sound effects. Yeah, yeah, that's the fucking hook and it doesn't have to be on beat. It doesn't have to be Because it's powerful. It has a message It's political. It's deep. It's different. It's what the people need But when I'm at Taco Bell, I don't eat meat Refried beans! That's what I'm doing. Fuck you Refried beans Refried beans. Refried beans. So aggressive, the anger. And I could write a verse with both of my ass cheeks spread wide open and a motherfucking blindfold on, bitch. Hi, I made a song about Mexican pizza because I love it so much. I wish that Taco Bell didn't discontinue it a year ago, and uh, this led me to this monstrosity of a beat that I just made. Refried. With the sauce and cheese Give you hell if you cross me We about to throw hands if you want try me This ain't been new, I will end you If you ever dare to go discontinued I don't share when I read from menu Y'all want everything I eat, I've been through Yes, I eat, I eat, I eat I like my pizza, what refried means Peep my ad, search YouTube This ain't even Mexican food But I don't care when the clock hits 2 a.m. p.m. If that is your mood Mexican pizza is the pizza for you and me. Mexican pizza is the pizza. Yeah, yeah. I remember when when I made my first song, fucking um, so high, right? And I, I was smoking all this weed. And I was like the stoner chick. And people thought that that meant that fucking I believed in third eye shit. And fucking I Ching. And, and fucking vibrations. <laughs> now every time I hear, I, I think about vibrations... Or somebody says something about vibrating, I just think of dildos. And <clears throat> my third eye is tingling. <laughs> so then I, I, I quit both of them. And then a couple days later, I was like, eh, I quit cigarettes. But what if I, what if I try weed again? I'm going to try. I'm going to smoke a little bit tonight. I'm going to smoke my friend's joint. And so I smoked a little bit of his joint. And, and... It was me, him, and another guy, and we were just in the studio. Is it my energy, my engineer? But then I'm smoking and I'm getting fucking higher or whatever. And everyone starts turning into demons. Yeah, I smoked a lot of cigarettes. That's why I sound like this. That's why somewhat, sometimes I sound like this when I talk. Nobody, nobody talks like this. Yeah, so today I was just hanging out at the park and I had my dog with me. And, uh, and then, no. That's not how I fucking, nobody talks like that, dude, unless you're insane. I think, so, I think that's what he was referencing, the fact that I was looking off into the distance and talking. Because it looks like I'm talking to somebody that's not there, maybe, I don't know. Who hurt you? <laughs> me. I'm emotional. Hi. What's up? Do my cat. 
Dude, my cat just woke up out of a deep slumber. He goes like this. That's how he wakes up. He's like this. Meow! Meow! Hi. Meow. What's up, baby? Meow. Uh-huh. And? Meow. You're so sweet. I love you so much. He's so good. <laughs> I'm so lucky. Aww. Anyway. My ball sack has grown to at least 90 centimeters and 90 yards in diameter since I have been on this fuck my ball sack can cover the circumference of the octagon at this point because I have fucking told my personal life to y'all dumb ass stupid ass bitches and I'm thinking it's oh it's all good it's all good now no that I'm single. <coughs> anyway, I'm just gonna have to walk around dragging my nuts along the road. I'm gonna be chafing a lot. Gonna be chafing my nuts. My nut sack is gonna be chafing against the road because I am s I have the biggest nut sack on the planet to be telling y'all motherfuckers what the fuck's going on in my personal life. Doesn't dragging my nuts along the road. While y'all got pants on. Pants don't hold the, the size of what my sack is. Pants cannot hold the size of what I am carrying right now. There is no jeans. Levi's has given up. No goddamn beekeeper suit that can hold my nut sack. No, I'm not high. I'm extremely pissed. I'm upset. Anyway, so I took my cats out onto a balcony because I thought that they would like some sun. I kept the door open and I left, there's like a closet and then a balcony. And then, so they can go back into the closet and out into the bedroom and then have their little life in there for the day because I wanted to open this window that's big as fuck that, you know, I didn't want them to like run away, but I still wanted them to be able to get fresh air. I open this fucking balcony, I walk away for five minutes and I come back and I see a bird swoop down like a whoop. and my cat is like, what the fuck? And so I looked it up on Google that ravens, they will only attack if they feel threatened. What are you threatened by? And also when they do attack, they don't even do anything other than poke your eyes out. So they're, it's not like they're trying to like rip you apart they just blind you and they fucking poke their fucking beaks into your brain sorry i'm so upset I if i see that raven one more time i will never run faster in my life i will have never ran, ran faster in my entire life that raven is gonna see a new side of me that nobody has ever seen i swear to god i'm not i'm not the mother i'm not the mother there's other mothers out there that you can mess with, that you can play with. Me, I'm different. I'm really different. I'm built different. I'm built. I'm built to last. I'm built. I'm built to fight. The thing is that Raven does not have an advantage over me. I don't give a fuck how intelligent it is. The intelligence doesn't intelligate past the intelligence of a seven-year-old kid. And yes, that sentence sounded insane, but I'm, I'm very riled up right now it doesn't have thumbs it doesn't have hands it doesn't have fists it doesn't have elbows it doesn't have anything like that all it has is two little french fry legs and some fucking talons that aren't gonna do shit and it has a fucking big ass beak i know i have highlights I know. but the raven but the raven like me. the yeah. fucking raven what about him tried to square up with both ray and alex just now really? on the balcony yeah me personally I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. What's threatening about my boys? Nothing. See it? See it? Bitch, I dare you. <laughs> land! 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 You're land! Stupid bitch. And guess what else? Guess what else? There's this, um, remember when I told you that there was a sound that I heard when I was alone and there was like, it was like a clicking noise, kind of like the alien from Signs <laughs> that traumatized no. me when I was eight years old? <laughs> that, guess who makes that fucking noise? <laughs> the fucking bird.
I, listen, I was sitting outside, right there, on the ground. Mm-hmm. I look up and I hear... <laughs> and I, I'm like, oh. And I turn around, I'm like, oh, it's you. You're the demonic presence. Yeah. Anyway, that bird is fucked. Do you see him? No. Flip him off. How do you know he's a raven? Is he not a hawk? No, it's a fucking raven because it's ugly as fuck and it's dumb and it almost tried to hurt my cats. Oh. Fucking bitch ass fucking bird. Stupid fucking stupid ass ugly ass bird. Bitch. We need a bald eagle. We need a bald eagle? Mm -hmm. Like an actual one or like a sculpture of one? No, we just need a rent one. I could just fly around for a little bit. You can do that? I'm actually pretty sure you There's can. There's absolutely no way you I'm can do that. I'm pretty sure you fly there all the and they'll scare the raven away. Like the raven will leave, leave? Like it'll pack its shit and leave? I cr- By the way, I cried. Why? I cried like a little girl. I was like... <laughs> like that. Because the, I was so sad about the cats. It's fucking Catterday and my cats just got assaulted. Whatever, that fucking bird sucks. And I hope he knows that I think that and know that. I hope he remembers my face.